Hi everyone, my name is Virginia Wade, and today we're going to talk about gemstones and color. Now, a real easy way to put the gemstones together with a color um, and their purpose would be to put like hematite together with onyx and black tourmaline with quartz. Now all of these gemstones that are black are good for protection. It makes it really easy. So all black stones are good to protect you. Instead of getting really involved and complicated and saying, well, hematite um, is protection and, and it also grounds you and you know, it's just very simple when you're first starting out with these gemstones. Just know that all black stones protect you. All red stones, like red jasper and red coral, uh, ruby, garnet, uh, which I don't have any on hand right now, uh, all the red stones are going to bring vitality and give you energy and make you, you know, um, more motivated to go achieve your goals. All kind of orangey yellow stones, these are carnelians, they're good for creativity and energy. So orangey yellow stones, uh, carnelian is basically uh, there aren't that many stones that are this color, kind of an orange-red. But it's good for creativity and to give you energy if you're tired. Now the yellow stones, more yellow gold, um, would be citrine and yellow calcite are a couple of them. You do have yellow cards too, but this is the yellow calcite. Kind of hard to see it. But anyway, uh, they're good for personal power and um, to strengthen your will. Uh, they're just really good for um, studying too. So all yellow stones will help your memory. Um, if you're in school, um, they'll help you study and remember um your studies all green stones are going to be good to calm you down uh, they're good for stress and they're also good to heal the physical body this happens to be an adventuring in the quartz um, family of stone uh, this is jade jade is a green stone very calming it kind of slows things down so if you have a lot coming at you, um, situations and things you have to deal with, carry a jade and that will kind of slow it down. Uh, Verisite, another green stone. So basically all green stones are going to heal the physical body, assist in healing it, uh, and balancing and bringing wellness to your physical body and also to calm you down. Uh, pink stones, rose quartz is the best one, will bring unconditional love. So all pink stones will work on the heart and bring unconditional love. Blue stones, you have lapis. All blue stones are going to be good for communication, self-expression, and creativity. This is a lapis lazuli. This is a blue calcite, and this is a kyanite. So they all do the same thing, generally speaking. Just keep it very simple. Uh, all purple stones, this is an amethyst, will bring spiritual awareness and protection. So any purple stone is going to bring you uh, spiritual awareness um, it's also good 
to calm the nervous system down and to reduce pain levels. And then of course, the quartz crystal uh, will magnify energy and protect and strengthen your aura. So these are some of the stones. Just remember, if you're first starting out with gemstones, that all black stones, no matter what they are, are good for protection. All red stones are good for vitality and energy. All orangey red stones are good also for vitality, creativity, Yellow to golden stones are good for your personal power and to strengthen self-confidence. All green stones are good for healing the physical body, assisting in that um, because our body can heal itself. And the green stones can calm you down and relax you. They're good for stress. Uh, the pink stone is good for unconditional love and the blue stones are good for creativity, self-expression, and communication. Then of course you have the amethyst. There's other purple stones too, but uh, the amethyst is the best for spiritual awareness. And the quartz crystal of course is also good not only to strengthen and protect the aura, but it's good for meditation too. So these are some of the gemstones that you may be interested in picking up and working with related to the colors. So we're going to close now, and I just want to let you know that um, I do cover some of the gemstones that are related to the archangels in my book, uh, Angels, Demons, Ghosts, How to Identify and Respond to Supernatural Spirits. And you can find this book on Amazon.com. I also have uh, YouTube videos on spirit and ghost communication, on psychic attack and spiritual protection, on the archangels, on the gemstones. So check it out if you want to subscribe, if you like. Um, you'll be able to see all these wonderful videos that are pretty interesting. Um, I have some interesting stories in them too. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>